So intramuscular injections are one of the most common types of injections that are administered today in the healthcare setting. A lot of our common vaccines like the influenza vaccine, pneumonia vaccine, hepatitis A and B, all of these are administered via uh, intramuscular injection. So the intramuscular injections most commonly is given in the up, uh, deltoid muscle of the upper arm. The first step to administering an intramuscular vaccine is to complete all paperwork and consent forms. You never want to administer a vaccine without having consent forms completely filled out and documented. The second step is to clean and prepare all the supplies that are going to be needed for the injection. So we'll need a syringe with a needle and then the injectable substance. It's important to make sure that an alcohol swab is used to clean the surface of the vial before it's drawn up into the syringe. And the third step is to locate the site, so the deltoid muscle of the arm. This is done pretty easily by making a C and putting the top of that C around the shoulder blade of the person that's, that's going to be injected. But you want to select a, a spot for the vaccine that is generally above the armpit, yet below the shoulder blade in the fattest part of the deltoid muscle. That's the site that you'll take an alcohol swab, clean and prep that site for injection. Once you have all your supplies ready, you've located and prepared a site for the injection. I use the 1-2-3 approach to intramuscular injection. So it's a fluid motion of one, inserting the needle all the way down to the bevel into the muscle. Step two is depress the plunger on the syringe as, as smoothly yet rapidly as possible. Remove the syringe as quickly and fluidly from the muscle as possible. Activate the safety device and dispose in the sharps container.